September Roses, by Jeanette Winter As I looked down at the roses, a young man walked to where, I stood, and told me how they came to be there. Far away in South Africa, he sat across the ocean. Over the mountain, beyond the desert. Two sisters lived together and grew roses. Their greenhouse overflowed with roses of every kind. Red roses, pink roses, yellow roses. Roses surrounded their little house. And roses brightened every room. Every night the sisters worked on designs for their rose display at the flower show, far away in New York City. When the designs were finished, they carefully packed 2,400 roses. It was time for their journey. High in the air, the two sisters sat dreaming of their roses. Then the sky turned black. Their airplane landed. There were tears enough to fell an ocean. The sisters sat in the airport with their roses all day. And all night, there was no place for them to go. Can I help you? I have a place for you to stay. How can we repay their kindness? Please take our roses we have no use for them now. I know a place for your roses. The man drove the sisters down through the city to Union Square. Your roses are needed here. The sisters knew what to do. They found an empty space on the grass and set to work. Placing one rose next to another and another, their hands moving quickly. The grass was soon covered with roses. When the sisters stepped back, there lay the fallen towers. And my tears fell on the roses. The End Hello everyone, today I am going to read, Ben Gives a Gift by Sarah E. Hoffman. I am Ben. I live on 1st Street. Miss Green lives here too, boo. I will give her flowers. I pick the flowers. I put them in water. I give them to Miss Green. The End I hope you enjoyed that story. If you would like to see these books uploaded daily go ahead and subscribe and don't forget to check out all the other stories uploaded. Thank you so much for watching.